big news. NFL schedule dropped today, tonight, rather. It's been leaking all day. We had, you know, news reports dedicated to, you know, the week one slate and everything like that. My Dallas Cowboys are going to be opening up the season against the defending Super Bowl champions, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. It's going to be one hell of a season, let me tell you that much. Let me tell you that much. It's going to be a couple of London games, of course, as usual. There's going to be some ABC games this year. It's only going to be one, you know, Monday Night Football game on Week 1, that doubleheader. That's moving to Week 18 on a Saturday. Of course, you know, all the usual festivities, Thanksgiving, quite at Christmas. Christmas? There's two games on Christmas? Oh, my goodness. And all sorts of different treats and tricks and beautiful matchups. In these 272 games over 18 weeks, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go completely in depth with everything because that takes a lot of time that I don't have. So what I am gonna say is is that we are in for another season of fantastic NFL storylines, and man, I cannot wait. It's a shame it's 17 games. It should be 18. Or 16, depending on who you ask. But, you know, hopefully CBA gets amended or something like that in between the new TV deals starting and whatever. Because um, I, I do not want to have to sit with 17 games until 2032. Or out of 2033 until the start of the 2033 season. But that's a different story for another day. The NFL schedule is out. I'm excited. I know all of you are excited. Tell me how you think your team's going to do. I honestly think the Cowboys will go 10 and 7 this year. That's what I'm thinking. That's what a lot of people have been saying. I'm going with that same sentiment about 10 and 7. Maybe, you know, 9 and 8. Maybe 8 and 9. It really depends. It really depends. But glad it's out. Man. There's just, just so much good stuff, man. Let me tell you that. All right. I'll see you guys later.